morning guys if you hear a noise it's Aaron cleaning carpet so he is cleaning it he's got some new tools and he he likes to use tools to clean anyway what time is it 9:57. it is Friday me Violet Hudson woke up real early and had fun all together played some alphabet go fish played some other games wrote stories anyway fun stuff now everyone's awake. My two big girls are at a friend's house and they had a sleepover. I had someone not happy that my kids were having a sleepover during COVID on a grocery haul. That's fine. You do you. I'll do me. <laughs> anyway, I am getting lunch going. We have a fall party that we're going to today. Yeah. It got quiet. So now all of a sudden I'm like, wow, where'd the noise go? Aaron stopped. Um, we have a fall, fall party we're going to go to with homeschool friends. Again, I'll do me. You do you. It's all going to work out. Um, and uh, are you excited about that? Yeah? So we are going to have snacks there, but I'm going to go ahead and feed us lunch before we go. We have to be there at 1.30. Um, I have to stop and get stuff. We're bringing drinks for the party. It's not a whole bunch of people, just a couple of families. But anyway, but I don't want us to be real hungry. There's going to be a bouncy house if it's nice enough. Of course, yesterday was 83. Today is like 40 and cold and wet a little bit. So that's how it goes. But I want us to have full bellies, and then also I know once we get home, sometime that evening, everyone's going to want to eat again, and I'll probably be tired, just honest. So, I'm going to go ahead and do dinner. I already have some ground beef prepped, because I had to make beef for that meat sauce that I made the other day. I'm not sure if I'm even going to post that video. Oh, it went horribly. You'll know. You'll find out if it was posted or not. So, I had meat prepped. So, we're going to do tacos, but I don't really feel like tortillas and all that so I'm also I wanted a sweet potato that's what I wanted I really wanted a sweet potato so I put sweet potato and regular potatoes in my instant pot and uh, people can do a taco stuffed potato if they want or they can put it in a tortilla and then I will have leftover potatoes I'm sure tonight or this evening this afternoon whenever we get back I'm trying to make some bouillon cube dissolve in my water here um, when we get back, we'll have leftover potatoes. We'll probably have leftover meat. And I'm also gonna do some Spanish rice. So I'm gonna do some, not this whole bag, some brown rice, a chicken bouillon cube, and some salsa in an instant pot also. So I just feel like I'm making enough stuff, we'll have leftovers. And then I got this asparagus last week on Friday. So I need to use it. So I'm gonna bake this asparagus. I think I'm gonna do it with some onion in my oven. And I might have some potato, asparagus, onion, a little bit of meat. I think that's what I'm gonna do. But between all this food, it's kind of like, a buffet we'll have leftover and it'll be good so we can eat now eat then all that stuff Hudson's about ready for his nap the girls have been keeping him busy but I'm gonna get my rice in my instant pot so I can put Hudson down huh yeah Liam's over there playing a coding game hi Liam <laughs> all right so here's my plate I got sweet potato the taco meat onions asparagus and that Spanish rice the kids are doing it in various ways. A lot of them are just doing it like regular tacos with refried beans. But anyway, this is our lunch for today. And we'll have lots of leftovers for this evening. Aria! Say hi. Hi. What you got? This is where you see it right here. Right there. Oh! Hey. Show them. Where'd you get that at? I got it at Dollar Tree. Yeah. Is that your Dollar Tree haul? Yeah. Yeah. What else did you get at Dollar Tree? I got ice cream and then I ate it at all of that all the time. <laughs> yeah, she did. It's cool, huh? What are we about to do? We are about to, we are about to what? We're about to stuff these diapers. We're about to stuff these diapers. Yeah. So, you want to help me? Yes. Yeah. All right, come sit over here. Yeah, Ari's going to help me. Um, We're done eating. It's almost noon, so we have a little bit. Liam and Violet are playing outside. Hudson just woke up from his nap, and he ate a little bit. He didn't eat very much. He choked, and so then he got sidetracked. Anyway, I have a Moses basket, oh, there's a burp, full of cloth diapers, and I'm going to <laughs> stuff them. I've had some people ask um, on Instagram where, uh, what I'm using, where I bought them. Which right now, dead. did he pull out one of his inserts? Right now, my whole stash, if you will, is either um, borrowed or given from friends because I wanted to be able to try out different kinds. And so I have one friend whose baby is not in them anymore and I'm borrowing them. And she has a few different brands so I can kind of see what I like best. And then I have another friend who had um, some overnight um, diapers and inserts that she doesn't need anymore and she just gave them to me. So, but I am, I did 
get some for myself and they'll be in soon. I have a couple of companies that sent me some to review for you guys. So that'll be fun. This is the best day. It's the best day. Wow. So anyway, when those come in, I'll be sure and show you guys those. But so far, we're liking it. I plan on doing a video, um, you know, all about it. You say hi? You say hi? But right now we gotta stuff some because our bucket's running low. I like to go ahead and stuff them all and have them ready to go in a little basket um, as opposed to stuffing one when I need it. That way I never have to wait. I can just change a diaper. Hudson, who's that cute baby? It's you. Who's that cute baby? It's you, Hudson. Did you have lots of beans for dinner, Aria? Your, her favorite thing about tacos is beans. Mm -hmm. All right, we're gonna stuff these diapers. Maybe you'll one day be a vlogger, huh? Yeah, yeah. they really like to um, film. Yeah, you're good at filming, too. I think we might need more kale. Then we'll move this and we'll put our eggs in here and make our omelet. There were goodie bags at our party yesterday, and this was in mine. Isn't that cute? Got goodie bags too. <coughs> crafts in it, so they are working on that this morning. Hudson, you sneezing? Sneezing all over. So fun. Ginger's of course involved. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna go ahead and get lunch going in the instant pot just so it's done. So I had some more meat prepped, and we had quite a bit of rice left over um, from the dinner last night or the lunch I made yesterday. So since they're already cooked, I just added in a big quart of chicken broth and then equal parts water and some bouillon cube and then I put in some green onion some peas garlic um, what else pepper uh, like garlic cloves onion powder and a splash of soy sauce and we're just gonna have like a hamburger soup or a meat and rice soup whatever you want to call it uh, for lunch slash dinner you know we have our lunch in the middle of the day so since everything's cooked I'm just gonna let this saute um, up you know till it's boiling and gets everything hot and then I'll put it on keep warm you see tomatoes because remember my rice was like a Spanish type rice um, anyway just gonna let it keep warm after that and kind of just like a come you can eat it when you're hungry and then I think we're gonna um, we want to make some bread I don't think we'll have it done in time for this but maybe for our evening meal or you know for tomorrow and we had some potatoes left too and I'm trying not to waste I'm having like a no waste challenge to myself um, you should get to watch me stir my soup now so with the leftover potatoes, um, I'm going to turn that into something also. But anyway, 
I'm gonna let this saute and then I gotta put Hudson to sleep and I'm not even ready for the day yet y'all it's 10 6 but it's Saturday so we're just kind of lazing around but we got some chores to get done we skimped on our chores yesterday so that's what we're gonna do put baby to sleep work on some chores eat some lunch all right now very tall Natalie haha joking she's on the footstool is going to make some biscuits to go along with our soup Violet's gonna help her what are you gonna play today Violet um, we're farmer boy. Farmer boy. Who are you going to be? I'm going to be Alice. She's going to be Alice. Is Natalie Eliza Jane? Yeah. Okay, I like that name, Eliza Jane. It's pretty. Yeah. Now we're going to turn it off because we're listening to worship music and we'll get copyright. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Two tablespoons baking powder. Is it for a tablespoon, Violet? It up. We're almost ready, huh? Boo, 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 boo. Slappers. Slapper kisses. Slapper kisses. <gasps> yeah. We had a really good time at the fall party. Hi. <laughs> Yesterday, we left at 1. We did not get home till 6 o'clock. Oh my goodness, it was so fun. Some other homeschool families were there. Lots of yummy treats and drinks and all that stuff. They had a bouncy house and there was lots of boys. So, Obviously, you know my family. We have two boys, and this one's not really playing with Liam. Um, so most of his life has just been him, and a lot of my friends have girls um, until just the last couple of years. And the ones who do have boys, we don't see as often. They have multiple boys. So yesterday, there was a lot of boys. Yeah, there was a lot of boys over there. <laughs> and Liam had a hey day. Rough playing, lightsaber playing, wrestling, just... He had a really good time. He was worn out when he got home. Yeah, huh? Hudson had a good time too. He said hi to all his friends. <laughs> anyway, but he just had such a, such a fun time. I can't talk. I'm all tongue-tied. So, but we got home and man, whew, we were tired. So, we just relaxed. And uh, so, we've been cleaning up this morning, like I said we were going to do. But that's why I did not pick up the camera. I took my camera to the fall party to vlog. Um, and the kids were in and out, in and out, just running. It would have been a blur to even get them. And they were outside a lot. But it was like maybe 50, 48-ish. And really windy. Now, they were bundled up. But I was not about to take Hudson out there um, to get clips. I figure, I didn't even take pictures. I didn't take a single picture. I just talked with friends. And that's all I did. So, anyway, our soup is done. Our biscuits are almost done. But I just wanted to stop and let you know, we did have a fun time. It just was not recorded. Lily is pulling random letters out of the Scrabble bag and putting them in alphabetical order. So that's fun. We should play Scrabble later. I love Scrabble. Okay, awesome. So we're using cloth diapers like you've seen. I've also, I've been using cloth wipes sometimes with disposable wipes also. But my cloth wipes, I've just been getting wet as needed and using them, which you can do. But I've been wanting the convenience of being able to just pull them out like I would disposable wipes 
all you people who don't have babies are now very probably bored with my channel. Turned into all things baby. But anyway, so to do that, I needed a wipe warmer. So I ordered one and it came in. Show. Wipe warmer. Um, anyway, so I'm going to try this out. I had good reviews. I hope it works. But um, I have to make the stuff to make them wet, you know? Anyway, so I'll show you what I'm using for that. I'm very tired and I have a sudden headache, so I'm not sure what's going on. I think it's just the weather going up and down. And then also my friend made me some burp cloths um, for my baby shower gift, and she made them extra small because I have another friend who she's also friends with. What is that glare on my screen? You don't see that glare? See that glare right there? Yeah. Um, I must have something on my lens. And uh, this friend used the burp rags as um, wipes, so she wanted them smaller. So the friend who made it for me made them small, so I'm gonna use them as the wipes, and also you can use just regular baby washcloths as wipes, so I'm gonna use both of those things. We'll see how this goes. First off, you just have to boil, this is a cup and a half of water. You bring it to a boil to kill off anything, or you can use filtered or distilled water. And then we're gonna do two tablespoons of coconut oil, a tablespoon and a half, I'm pretty sure I'll have to double check, of, um, baby soap this is young livings it's lavender and five drops of tea tree oil to kill any you know it's like antifungal there's different recipes you can use depending on what you want some don't call for this you can use different oils some you can use different um, essential oils just different things you want to make sure that's safe of course um, this has essential oil lavender in it so this is what I'm gonna be using there's a bunch of different recipes for um, baby wipes this is just what I chose so I'm gonna add these things in here and get that all mixed up and then uh, go to the next step you'll want to melt obviously your coconut oil and this is why you need the wipe warmer because obviously this coconut oil would solidify again um, and that would be gross so the wipe warmer keeps it all nice and warm that way your coconut oil stays melted and then the tea tree oil is because since it's staying moist and warm you obviously don't want fungus growing so that tea tree oil is an antifungal now I gotta double check my measurements on my soap and I'll get that added in. Okay, these are what I'm using for the wipes and you can do baby washcloths too. And I have some of those and I might use those. I'm gonna try these first. These fill up, I don't even think I can fit them all in here. Um, my wipe warmer and I read and all you really need to do is just put these in and pour this on top. So that's what I'm gonna do and we'll see if it works. You think it's gonna work, buddy? <coughs> Bless you. <coughs> Bless you. <coughs> I don't even think we can fit all of those. Let's pour some on. I don't really see how this works, but it says it does. So we're going to trust it. Can't fit them all. We can't fit them all. Oh yeah, that's getting all of those really wet. Definitely, definitely. Okay, we couldn't fit them all. We're missing three. That's okay. I didn't count it on how many this is. But it really, I just poured it on there and so far they seem like they're all really absorbing it. Um, I kind of messed around like you saw and just like took some and flipped them around. It said just to pour them in your wipes once they're in the wipe container. I think once we close the lid and it all gets warm and you know wipes aren't dripping wet anyway we'll see if it doesn't work then next time i might put them in here and swish them around and then fold them and put them up but i think it's gonna work i'll let you guys know if that works if not we'll try something different together and these are my three that didn't work so i'll just put these away and um i said you can leave them in here for like three days you should go through those in about three days anyway just for any fungus reasons but i did put tea tree oil in there it says that can extend the life but we'll see how long this lasts and how it goes it's an experiment we'll find out how it works all right guys i think i'm going to end the vlog here got a little bit of yesterday a little bit of today it's about two o'clock um aaron does work today it's saturday but he works so we're just all gonna have a saturday um i'm hoping my headache goes away i want to film another video for my unschooling series i was like super surprised everyone was really into that um so that's fun and you guys had a lot of good questions and comments and all that so you guys seemed excited to hear more about it so i'm hoping to be able to sit down this evening and film a little bit more because i have so many topics i can go through on that it'll be fun 
We'll see. Hudson's talking over here. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and close this vlog out. Go play with the kiddos for a little bit. Let my headache get better and then hopefully film that. So I hope you guys are having a wonderful week and we'll talk to you next time. Bye, y'all.